What is up everybody, Garden State Aviation here, back with another video. In this video, I'm going to be unboxing this model that I got at a trade with my friend Aviation MD in Maryland. Without further ado, let's get started. So before we open the box and take a look at the model, let's take a look at the box it's packaged in. So this is just standard Gemini Jets packaging. You have the Gemini Jets logo, clip out of the aircraft, type of aircraft, United logo. And on the inside, we have the Gemini Jets flap, which you guys can pause the video to read. And we have that flap. And on the side of the box, it is standard Gemini Jets, as you guys can see on all sides. And at the back of the box, we just have the clip out of the aircraft, all the reasons why you should buy a Gemini Jet or whatever. And we have the type of release, or year of the release, which is 2019. So now that we've taken a look at the box, let's unbox the model. And here we have the model. Now let's head on to the detail segment for this model. Starting off with the detail segment for this Gemini Jets United model, we have the cockpit windows, Star Alliance logo for landing gear with the serial number of the aircraft, which is 2796. We have the L1 door, Old United logo, L2 door, Wi-Fi hub slash HUD, antenna, and there's no emergency exits on the wings, which uh, I don't know if it's a flaw with the model or if it's per its real life counterpart. But continuing on down the aircraft, we have the L3 door, a few more antennas, the American flag, the registration of the aircraft, which is number 796 Uniform Alpha and 796 UA, the L4 door, and the serial number of the aircraft, which is 2796 on the back of the fuselage. And of course, here we have United's Continental Globe tail. And turning around the model and looking at the right side, we have some cargo doors on the right side of the model, which is the only difference between the two sides. Taking a look at the wings, the wings do appear to be level, along with the fan blades, which are pretty well done on this model. And on the bottom of the fuselage, I'll zoom out so you guys can see, we just have the Gemini Jets logo and the landing gear, which uh, it tilts up like this, and it tilts down like this. And uh, yeah, besides that, that really is all there is to this model. So the reason why I got this model is because United obviously fly their 777-200s to Newark, and I did trade my uh, Blue Evo United 777-300, but I'm just waiting for NG to release it, so it wasn't really that big of a loss for me uh, to get this model. But uh, yeah, that being said, that does conclude this video. If you guys like the video, please like, subscribe, and turn the notification bell to so see my videos, and comment down below what you think of this video format, and if you want more videos like this. Once again, thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you guys in the next video. As always, goodbye.